I feel that um, diversity and freedom is what our industry should be fighting for. And that means the, diver like, that means the freedom to create really hardcore experiences and to create male power fantasies, but also to have the ability to have softer games and more accessible games and games for disabled people and games for LGBT people. And, um, and, I, and I think that not necessarily the games industry it, itself, but the perception of the games industry is that we should be making games in a certain way. And that's our tradition, you know? And it is the tradition, but we need to move forward, you know? I guess I think some people are short-sighted and they, they see the limits of video games and they, they think that games can only be this. And I think we can be so much more. I think that by and large, most games are really inaccessible and aren't trying at all to tell a variety of stories, right? Forget about even the word accessible. Let's tell different stories. Let's, let's tell stories that aren't about killing and winning and getting all the money, right? Because imagine if all movies were like that or imagine if all books were like that. It would be monotonous. It would be dreary and boring. And that's how a lot of people see the games industry. So let's, you know, let's, let's try and tell different stories and let's celebrate that. Let's, let's put the effort into talking about unusual stories and, and stories that move us and, and make the efforts to, to go out and find things that break us out of our safety zone and, and, and things that challenge us as humans.